Good afternoon, Sean. People gathered at St. Paul's Church in Concord yesterday to remember those lost to violence. The service was just one of several events that will take place this week in New Hampshire as part of Crime Victims' Right Week. Those who attended said their loved ones may be gone, but they are not forgotten. The names and ages of nearly 200 Granite Staters killed in violent incidents were read one by one. Those who have lost family and friends to violence say they are forever tied together through tragedy. Anton Soyes has been singing at the memorial for the past 27 years following the death of her niece, Karen Barlow, who was killed in a drunk driving accident. Attendees said having the memorial each year helps with the grieving process. Some state officials will gather at St. Paul's Church Monday for a press conference related to Crimes Victims' Rights Week. Reporting live here outside the St. Paul's Church in Concord, New Hampshire, I'm Riley King for WMUR News 9. Sean, back over to you.